I drove out on an October day uh, to do research for the project this past October. It was beautiful. I didn't quite know where I would be going yet, so I, I stayed in Ennis and I drove uh, up and down the road and it, the light was extraordinary. Uh, got up the next morning and the California smoke had obscured everything. You could barely see the mountains. And it was like, oh man. Uh, it was, but it, I was able to spend that day uh, learning about it. We drove around, we looked at things, we, uh, you know, uh, got close to the, the, the grasses and the birds and the water. And uh, uh, Jeff was really able to give me a, a more than just, I mean, visually it's stunning, but uh, the, the, the background, the ideas, the philosophy, the uh, uh, history. Uh, and uh, the next morning I got up very early, it was still dark, I thought I'm going to go out there. And uh, I came out, and that morning the sun was coming up, still behind the mountains. The smoke, some of the smoke had cleared, but there was an, an, enough hydrocarbons in, in the atmosphere to collect light that was coming up from behind the mountains. And it was truly magical. And uh, I thought, oh, thank you. I got back from that trip and really I just uh, sat down and started sketching and drawing and uh, thinking about everything we had talked about. And uh, uh, it was, it was it was uh, a, a wonderful experience. I, we were able to. I, I found that vision, and it was that it was that early morning that made the difference. Right now, you know, it, it's it's beautiful now, but you get that magic light right at dawn and right at dusk, and uh, we're. Uh, it, it is uh, that's why they call it magic light.